Greetings and welcome back to another very quick tutorial. Gleb Alexander here and today we are gonna take a look at game location texture. We are gonna texture small game location by hand. Uh, what is it? What you see on the screen is just one model with one texture and one UV map done in Blender. So, it's a mega texture-like approach. If you play it Rage, you probably saw that the world is just one big texture and we're gonna do something like that. Frankly, I love this approach. Maybe it's not often too optimal because it's rather inconvenient way to texture the game level because you cannot reuse stuff, you cannot uh, use the modular approach, you just have to stick with one big texture. But it's very performant, your mobile will be totally happy to run this game. So what are we gonna learn from these upcoming tutorials? First, we're gonna download the model from BlendSwap. And uh, so we aren't starting from scratch, we're starting from the model and we're gonna block out the main shapes. Then we'll retopologize it using various techniques such as uh, dissolving the edges and vertices. It's about an optimization and fitting in the polygon limit. The next step will be consolidate all the parts of the model and to make a texture atlas. This way we will be able to detach the parts of the model later on and still retain our UV maps. The next stage will be texture painting in Photoshop and then projecting it back onto the geometry in Blender. And basically this is what we do, we project stuff onto the geometry. Uh, then we will continue working on our texture in Photoshop and then uh, we will clone the parts from second UV map to fill the blank spaces. The last stop of our journey will be to bake the texture in Blender or in Unity. After that you probably will start making your own game, will sell it and become rich and all this stuff. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this little intro, I'm very excited to present uh, these tutorials, I hope they will be ready in the next few weeks. Thanks for watching, it was Gleb Alexandro and we will see you the next time.